G'day. Today what I'm going to show you is uh, how to pull a dents up with an oxy torch. Um, this HQ door I'm repairing with uh, hammer file finish, mostly file finish. I can't get to the other side of the panel in order to pull the dents up. And if you look here, you might just see a little bit of a low spot. So to determine where a low spot is, I'll run the file over the area. It's a little bit high there, and I can see there's a, a bit of a dent there. Now, one of the things I'll do is arm myself with a moist rag, and that's mostly to catch the problem more than, uh, than cure it, and just in case I overheat it too much. So, what I'm doing is I'm using the light, and it's as quick as that, and I can run the file and straight away you can see that that's the high spot. So that's a little bit too far. Quick little quench with the rag. And you can see that that's starting to file up nice and flat. With not a lot of effort. But what you want to look for is an even blend of file mark. Here it's quite high and when you run your hand on it quickly you can feel that that's quite high. Now one way I would get that down is of course with my favourite uh, shrinking disc. I just run my hand on there quickly and I can feel where it's starting to go. So that's shrunk that area down nicely and I got rid of that high spot very quickly and running the file over it I can then pick where the low spot is still. You won't get it all in one hit so what I'd recommend is just you're keeping an eye on where the metal is going. If it sucks in then stop. As you can see there that was a low spot that's now brought up and even again. All of this here is becoming a slight high spot. The door has a bit of dish in here so that tells me that that's correct. The edge of the door is correct but in here is a little bit on the low side. And I'll quite happily put a little bit of heat on like this. Quick file straight away that's brought that back up. You can use a bit of body filler of course and that will sort the problem out, but I'm not here to be a uh, bog sculptor, I'm here to be a panel beater. And I hate doing bog work. There's a little tiny dent just here. Let's see if we can get him out. Yeah, I reckon that was too much heat because you can see it's just coming up there. Now the reason I give that a quick quench is just to pull it down. It'll find its own way down shortly, but if I just keep on putting heat into it, this whole panel will eventually get quite warm and it won't give me a true indication of where it needs to be at rest. Rest is what I would call the panel when it's got no heat in it and it's just at its normal ambient room temperature. So you set a bit of damage on the on here. There's a bit of a low spot just there. Let's see if we can get that one up. So in short, 
I'll happily spend a few hours going around the whole panel like this and getting all the panel to rise up and even even level finish. Don't panic too much about a few little low spots here and there. When you look at the pattern of the uh, filing you'll be able to see. Now what I'll do, the camera's probably not showing that so I'll take the camera off its stand. And there you go, you can see the file finishes there. It's going to be a bit tricky trying to do this one handed but we'll give it a crack. Doesn't need much heat at all. Now as that's cooling, this ridge here is disappearing. That ridge is disappearing. So you can see there, just very quickly, how it's getting rid of all of the, uh, the low spots. I'll just have another crack at these ones. Now, you've noticed I haven't picked a hammer up once. And that doesn't mean to say that there will be no hammering. What it does mean is that I can get most of the torch off there, sorry about that. So that sort of gives you a bit of an idea and I go over the whole panel like this and within a few hours we've pretty much got everything back up to a nice level finish and that can be finished off with a bit of high fill primer. Okay so that concludes how to pull dents up with uh, a gas torch.